everyone, my name is Lupita and welcome to the Cookie Couture, where flavor and design collide. Today I want to share with you how I made a Mexican themed cookie, but in this time I wanted to be a little original and instead um, of doing something that is very common, I make um, a little Mexican doll cookie that is super, super cute. I hope that you really like it. This is inspired in the dolls that they sell in Mexico in the streets that are like rag dolls that are super super cute and I think so that they will look super cute in your Mexican theme party to celebrate the Independence Day or Cinco de Mayo or any Mexican festivity that you have to celebrate okay so I hope that you really like it and um, what I use in this cookie is a technique that I use a stencil and I'm going to share with you how you can make your stencils at home even though you don't have like a particular stencil you can do it and um, I'm going to share with you a slideshow of the pictures that I did with this and if you have any questions just leave me a comment and I will be very happy to tell you um, and I hope that you like it so let's get started technique that I use is super simple because I just made a stencil and the way that you can do a stencil is like if you just have any figure that you would like to do it you can use this kind of material that is for laminating that you can get in any of your copy centers so I am going to draw um, this one I had it for a long long time it's just like a regular silhouette of a little queen or virgin and um, I'm going to use just the inside of it, put it here, and this is an edible marker. I am going just to trace here, and then I'm going to cut, and then this is going to be my stencil that I will use it to make a lot of these cookies. So when you use stencils, the good thing is that all your cookies are going to look the same and when you're going to sell cookies, you want all your cookies to look the same. So this is the great thing about using stencils. Okay, now I'm going to cut it. you the pictures of the process that I did to make this beautiful doll cookie. Here I have the colors that I'm going to use. I'm going to use flesh color, green, red, and white. And now I am going to use my stencil that I just made. And with my edible marker, I'm going to trace that into my cookie. Now using my white icing, I'm going to make all the border and also I'm going to make like a little sleeve. Now I am going to put the flesh color icing on the the little face and you 
we're gonna use the red and the green icing to make the little dress. Our cookie is completely dry. Now we're gonna put a little bit of white icing in the top of her dress. dry and then add some sprinkles very well now we're going to decorate the top of her little dress and this is the way that I like to do like an embroidery effect if you can click the link above I have made some other cookies similar to these ones so first I start putting a little bit of icing and then I put the big and then squeeze so the icing is around important that your cookie completely dry because if not all this little glitter is gonna get stuck in your cookie if it's not completely dry okay I am going to use a clean um, brush to clean up all the excess of the glitter and I am ready to do the final touches um, I'm going to use an edible marker to make the eyes and the mouth and the nose
tutorial and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and also you can follow me on my social media on my instagram my twitter and my pinterest and also if you have any questions just leave me a comment and i will be very happy to read it and answer it for you and i think so that's it see you next time bye bye